you're you're exactly right. We walk in the room, we wash our hands, but yet we take something that we've been using on other people and lay it on your chest. Public health specialist Dr. Steve Fagans told me, well, most providers know to wipe down a stethoscope with alcohol between patients. Observational studies of healthcare providers now show that as few as one in five providers actually do that on a regular basis. So the stethoscope has now been associated with more healthcare associated infections or HAIs as they're called, as well as spores, drug resistant bacteria, viruses, and even emerging resistant fungi such as Candida auris. Since the alcohol wipe down gets rid of some of these, but not others, such as norovirus or a common hospital infection known as C. diff. And so what we do is we have these little, they look like ovens, ultraviolet devices. And many, many of you have them now. You put your phones in there you, 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 and, and you put your stethoscope in there prior to rounds and sometimes after rounds. That kills everything. Now, researchers are also looking into adding barrier protections for a stethoscope. This would be all part of standard infection control. That would mean that just like we protect our hands and our bodies now with gloves or gowns, these barriers would protect our skin against germs from the stethoscope. I'm medical reporter Liz Bonus. Back to you. You can always get local stories right here on YouTube, but go ahead and hit that subscribe button to get notifications to stay in the know.